Hey, what's up guys? Andrew Strip coming at you guys today with a brand new video. It's been uh, about a week since I've done a video. Um, I was actually in Yellowstone all week with my family, just doing all that fun stuff with the geysers and and whatnot. Um, so I feel like it's been a little while since I've done a lot of blueberry collections. Um, you know, I had a lot of stuff coming up, but uh, let's just go ahead and jump into this. So I do have two packages here. I have a package from Vinegar Syndrome uh, for their Halfway to Black Friday sale, as well as a package from Ronin Flicks. Um, got the Vinegar Syndrome package. I get, so I got home late last night. This was already here waiting for me. The Ronin Flicks just arrived this morning. Um, but yeah, guys, let's just go ahead and jump into this. And um, I will have another update probably tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna be getting, I'm not gonna say what yet, but. I will have three steel books for you guys to check out along with digital codes I think um, I'm getting those later today and then I'll uh, I'll do a video unboxing for you guys for that tomorrow um, also I am almost at 500 subs and I'm currently kind of working on something unique um, I don't want to say too much about it yet and give it away but um, I thinking if I hit 600 because that's probably around the time i'd actually be able to have this done by um i might release something really cool for you guys but who knows just keep that in mind let's go ahead and start with the ronin flicks package here since it's just one movie in here um and i ordered this one on i think like tuesday and it got here today so it's pretty fast shipping all right let's see what we got so inside we just have the packing slip get to the actual blu-ray here I really like this packing it's very protective all right and I think that's everything yeah I didn't get anything else I think they had a for this release they had a, like a limited edition poster that you can get if you're like one of the first people to buy it I think but I could be wrong um, but the cover on this is just ridiculous. So that is Shredder. I've never seen this, um, but the artwork definitely captured my eyes. That's just absolutely gorgeous. Very, very intriguing. Um, definitely can't wait to check this out, but this is a uh, horror hits the slopes with this in this slasher cult classic about a gang of snowboarders on a one way chairlift to terror. Um, Lindsay McKinnon or McKeon, uh, and Scott Wagner, and Brad Hawkins star in this scare-filled, laugh-packed weekend of horrors as a homicidal maniac with a grudge against snowboarders turns a snowy getaway into a body count nightmare when seven hot-blooded co-eds break into an abandoned ski lodge. Soon the wild parting turns into a desperate fight for survival and it isn't, before, it isn't long before they discover that on the slopes. No one can hear you scream. Um, this does come with some special features. You do get the brand new on-camera interview with the star, Lindsay McKe McKeon. Brand new audio commentary with the director, outtakes, and original trailer. Um, but like I said, that artwork is just amazing. So let's go ahead and open this one up for you guys so you guys can check it out. But yeah, like I said, I think if you're like one of the first, however many people, you got like a poster too. I kind of got to this a little late, but... So we'll take the slip cover off. You got the same artwork here on the front. And here is the backside for you guys. Oh, actually, never mind. The poster is inside. So we did get that. So I'll show that to you guys in just a second here. Uh, we do got some absolutely gorgeous disc art, which I absolutely love when companies do that. And then we do have some reversible art with, with the original artwork on here. See that right there. Yeah, this is very very nice um release definitely competitive to like scream factory and arrow i would say um they wrote in flicks i i have only bought in a few of their releases but they every release i've owned um has absolutely been phenomenal the transfer looks great as well so that is shredder and let me show you guys the poster real quick for that <clears throat> so it's just a little mini poster but it does come with the newly commissioned art. So that's really cool. 
I'll probably just keep that in the Blu-ray for collector purposes. But yeah, guys, that is that from Ronin Flicks. Make sure you guys go check them out. I think they still have some copies in stock. I know they also have, uh, um, I think, Just Before Dawn on there, too. That's like a limited release. Um, I'm not too sure what's all in this package, to be honest. I kind of ordered it a while ago and, and kind of forgot. I know I spent more than I probably should have, but they were some fantastic items that they had on their website. Um, so let's go ahead and crack this to open. I was actually really worried about this package because I knew it was going to be arriving while I was not here. And uh, luckily my neighbor, super nice, and grabbed the package for me um, since he knew that we were not going to be here. So let's start with what we got here in the bottom before we get to the movies. Um, we have a kind of bent unfortunately but it's a vinegar syndrome sticker which will be fine though because once I actually stick it something it won't be um i have a few of these but they're like a dollar so i grabbed another one this was something i was really excited about um it's a this is new from them actually this is a vinegar syndrome like shelf divider movie divider uh, so you can put these on your bookshelf kind of showing where your vinegar syndrome collection lies they had this one they also had another one that's more of like a size it's like a blu-ray it's like thick wood it's actually probably bigger than a blu-ray it's a big block that has the vinegar syndrome logo on the side um but that one was quite a bit more expensive so i just went ahead and picked up one of these for now i probably will pick up another one so i have one in the beginning one at the end but i really really dig this i think this is just super unique different um i would love to have like Scream Factory and Arrow shelf dividers like this, that would be phenomenal. But yeah, really cool. Decided to snag that one up to see how it is and it looks great. <clears throat> so it looks like I got five movies here for you guys. Um, oh man, yeah, these look great. All right, well, let's go ahead and start with this one. This is actually one that was, I was gonna pick up at Texas Frightmare Weekend, but I had missed out because I waited too long to grab it. Um, this is Splatter University here. They have it with the slip cover. Um, and this does, I think, have reversible art. Let's actually crack this release open. But in my opinion, Vinegar Syndrome is probably the best with their slip covers. They're just super thick and nice quality. Um, definitely worth the, the money, in my opinion. Um, they just have it on this really nice, thick material. Or paper. Thick stock paper. Um, so here is the Blu-ray out of the slip cover here. Got the back side as well. And basically, this is uh, years ago, a madman escaped from an asylum, slashing his way through a free no, uh, through th ugh, slashing his way through to freedom and continuing his bloody rampage at a nearby Saint uh, Trinian's College. Now, years later, new teacher Julie Parker begins to sense that something isn't quite right at the at the small town college, and it's not long before students and fellow faculty members begin disappearing, or worse yet, are found brutally butchered. Determined to uncover the truth behind. The ongoing violence, Julie begins her own investigation, unaware that she's putting herself at risk of becoming the ruthless murder's next target. Uh, the special features include new scan and restoration, or newly scanned and restored in 2K from its 16mm original camera negative. Uh, commentary tracks, get quite a few commentary tracks, audio interviews, still gallery theme song, script gallery, radio spots, original trailer, TV spot, reversible cover art, and subtitles. Um... Oh, I forgot that you have the little cover tags on here. Let me get this off real quick. All right. So reversible artwork. Go and flip that around for you guys. Which is just awesome as well. Splatter University. Earn a higher degree in terror. So this sounds like a blast. I'm really excited to check this one out. Um, and then, of course, this is a Blu-ray DVD combo pack. I love it when they put the artwork on there. It's absolutely fantastic. So that is Splatter University. Um, the next one up. <clears throat> I know, I think, two of these are semi-new. Um, they had some limited editions that were like exclusive to the sale. Um, I am blanking on the names right now, but I decided to pass on them. I kind of went for some more that were on sale, ones that I needed. Um, 
which was totally fine. But uh, the next one, I'm just sorry, I'm already ripping this one open. I just wanted to get the plastic off of it real quick for you guys. But uh, I've actually never heard of this one um, until recently, and I was reading about it, and it just absolutely sounds awesome. Definitely sounds like my kind of a kind of film. All right, so artwork on here is and title. Uh, there's nothing out there, and this is this artwork definitely captured my eye too. It's the backside, and once we get that slip cover off, there's the front artwork and the back. And that's the reversible art. I already flipped it for you guys. Um, so this one is Mike is always getting in the way of, of fun. And his obsession with horror movies and the rules dictates that no matter where he goes, he can't help but expect a, to find a monster lurking around every corner. But this time his paranoia, paranoia might be justified. After being invited to a remote lodge along with some friends, Mike immediately begins to sense that something isn't right, but none of his friends believe him. Unfortunately, they're dead wrong, and the slimy alien fog, frog monster has indeed landed in the nearby woods and set out to fulfill its mission to killing all human males and making with uh, mating with females. Can Mike convince his friends that there is nothing out there before men have their brains sucked out and women are carrying green mutant fetuses? <laughs> um, yeah, this just sounds ridiculous. Special features include, it's a new 2K scan, you get uh, some interviews, quite a few interviews, commentaries, and a uh, 20th anniversary commentary, archival group commentary, um, let's see, commentary with the hysteria continues, archival interviews, um, it looks like there's some short films on here, uh, an early feature film, quite a few shorts actually, Mood Boobs, a short film. Um, behind the scenes of Mood Boobs, theatrical trailer, music video, production, still galleries, behind the scenes, rehearsal footage, pre-production footage and video storyboards, original cast auditions, animation, test footage and deleted shots, reversible cover art and subtitles. So this thing is loaded with freaking bonus features. You guys can see all of that right there. Um, pretty insane. So here is the disc artwork for you guys as well. If you want to check that out. Um, but yeah, this one just sounds ridiculous and lots of fun. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm trying to go send my quickly here so you guys don't have to wait forever. Uh, this was another one I just missed out on picking up at Texas, so made sure I snagged it now. And that is Bloody New Year here with that terrifying cover art. Here is the back side of that as well. Really, really dig this. Go ahead and pop this off. We have the reversible artwork there. Or actually, I think that's still the newer commissioned artwork let me flip it around to the reversible for you guys and i'm sure a lot of you guys know about this one already um this is after finding himself stranded on a remote island a group of young friends discovered that the only structure is an old hotel which seems inexplicably inexplic inexplicably stuck in 1959 and stranger still has end up christmas it has up christmas and new year's decorations despite its it being the middle of summer, as the youngsters take shelter for the evening, increasingly weird events begin to occur as each of the hotel's unexpected guests meet a gruesome fate. Special features include a new 2K scan, get a commentary track with the director, reversible artwork, and subtitles. So this thing's not as loaded as the other releases, but still great. And Vinegar Syndrome always does a great job with their transfers. From everything I've watched, at least, everything's just like gorgeous. But I, I wish I could order more from Vinegar Syndrome. I don't order them from them too often. I usually do wait till their Black Friday sale or their halfway to Black Friday sale. Sometimes I'll pick up a few uh, limited releases here and there. But they are definitely costly. Um, so here is the original artwork there, the reversible art, which I always remember seeing this on VHS covers. Um, just very very uh memorable artwork i guess you could say uh so these two are not technically new releases but they were new to the sale because they actually came with slip covers so these are films that they've released in the past without slip covers um actually that one of them may have had a slip cover i can't remember it may have been a different one um 
but yeah, they basically release these slip covers individually, uh, which is really cool that they're starting to do that for any other titles that may have not had a slip cover. Um, or you could buy the movie with the slipcover and a combo. So I figured since I didn't have these two movies, I would do that. First one up here, which I said might have had a slipcover, is Demonoid. Never seen this film. Um, you might you might want to kill me for that. Because, um, I, I mean, obviously I've heard nothing but amazing things about this film. And I've wanted to see it for so many years. So there it is out of the box there. Uh, this is a... At a dig in rural Mexico, a British industrial accidentally unleashes an ancient evil, a severed hand possessed by a vengeful demon that attacks, kills, and takes over the hand and mind of anyone who interferes with its ruthless, or its ruthless quest for violence. Determined to stop the bloodshed, the wife of the industrialist joins forces with the renegade priest, but will they be able to conquer the evil hand before the forces of hell overtake them? Extras includes a new 2K scan, alternative international version, uh, macabre, macabre a new video interview with the director multiple theatrical trailers and tv spots reversible cover art with the international macabre artwork original artwork gallery subtitles french soundtrack by for macabre um so let's go ahead and open this one all the way up and i'm almost there guys i just got one more after this feels good getting new movies <laughs> i feel like i haven't done this in a little while all right so i don't know which cover art i want to want um i don't know it's kind of tough i'll show you guys both and you tell me what you guys think so you guys already saw this cover art here which is absolutely gorgeous and then if we flip it over, we get the Macabre cover art, which I kind of leaning more towards so, I think, because I really kind of dig the yellow spine on it. And that's this one here. So that's absolutely gorgeous, but I really dig the yellow spine, so I think I might keep it as this one. Um, but this, uh, so yeah, that's pretty much the Macabre or Demonoid release with that fantastic slip cover. Um, and then the last release, which is probably the one I'm super excited the most about because this is one I've just been needing to own for the longest time. Um, I don't think I own it already. No, I don't. <laughs> I had to double check, but the slipcover on this is really cool. Um, that is Slaughterhouse. So this comes in this big, thick packaging um, hardcover box that has blood all over it. And it actually slides out like this. Need to pull the film out. So it's kind of a different type of slip cover, which I really dig. And then, uh, of course, inside you got Slaughterhouse. And this is a uh, Lester Bacon Slaughterhouse has run into its financial problems faced with the town lawyer, the sheriff, and the rival Slaughterhouse owners trying to purchase his land. Lester decides to make matters in his own hands after discovering the type of violence his hulking and mentally deranged son, Buddy, is capable of. Lester orders him to permanently dispose of anyone who conspires against them. Special features include new 2K scan, commentary tracked with the director, producers, new video interview with the lead actress making a low-budget indie featurette, producing Slaughterhouse interview, archival interviews with Rick uh, Rossler, um, epilogue 30 years after the slaughter, radio interview featurette from 1987, local news coverage from the premiere, behind-the-scenes featurette outtakes, no smoking Slaughterhouse snipe, multiple theatrical trailers, TV spots, and radio spots. Uh, shooting script gallery, reversible cover art, and the subtitles. So this is actually a pretty big release with uh, bonus features as well. I'm crack this one open. This video is already 20 minutes. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I know you didn't want to watch something this long. I was trying to be quick. Um, so inside, we it is a Blu-ray DVD combo pack. Got the same artwork on both discs, which at least it has artwork, so I'm not going to complain there. Um, that's actually pretty funny. The reversible art is pretty much identical. Um, <laughs> so... 
you have this one that says slaughterhouse across with the quote up there or you have this one that says slaughterhouse on top with the quote down here so you kind of have a, a little bit of a choice um i'll probably go with the one that says slaughterhouse on the top there nice and clean looking uh so that is the brand new slaughterhouse release from vinegar syndrome which you can even see like on here like you can see all the bones there's just a lot of detail and a lot of love put into the release like this so very excited to own this um anyways guys that is it for this video uh nice little blu-ray collection update for you guys check out some good stuff um <clears throat> if you let me know what you guys think down below and uh, stay tuned like i said i will have another video in the next day or so um with some steel books unboxings and hopefully some codes to give away to you guys but yeah guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video